this is just a hard drive replacement of the Lenovo uh, E450. Um, so it's just three screws, one, two, three. So I took those all out. And then um, they have little washers on the end, so the screws don't actually come out. And then um, here, you'll notice uh, there's a little tab. So you pull this one up, and then you can use a pry tool to kind of pop the tabs out here. Oh, sorry. Pop the tabs out here and around here. But what you'll notice is when you get to this point, it's not going to go. So you pull it up here, pull it up from the back, pry it up from the back, and then you'll get it so that all these tabs pop out. And then you can pull it out. Because these aren't tabs, you'll break them if you just try and pry them up. And um, if you just pry up from here, you're probably going to break it here. So, something to note. Be careful. Um, so there's the RAM slots, the wireless card, the CMOS battery. Um, so I already did install it, but I'll show you here how I went about it. So it's just four screws. One, two, three, four. Just lift it out. Pull it. And, um, and the bracket was a little tricky. So there are four screws in the bracket. One, two, three, four. And I took those all out. And then um, kind of just push at the, uh, at the bottom here. And it will lift out of the bracket. And um, it'll come out of the rubber. You could take the rubber off entirely, make your life easier. And then um, it'll push out of the bracket. And then once you get it out enough, there's glue right up here. So just stick your finger in there and just kind of work the glue or the tape, work the tape off of the drive. You can see it's actually stuck in there right now. Anyway, um, push it back down. When you're putting it in, you got to get all this rubber out of the way. Otherwise, it's not going to sit in there again. And then you put the rubber back on. I don't know why they use this type of bracket. It's weird. So, put my screws back in. Yeah, so the rubber should cover the entire, all the silver part of the bracket. Okay, good. I'll slide it back in. These screws back in. It is a seven millimeter hard drive, so that's the old one there. So I'll just snap it all back in. Don't forget, slide it in there and then start snapping. That's it.